Elon Musk fans will certainly adore the concept of a smartphone that connects to everything Tesla. But what about those of us who believe that controlling a flamethrower with a smartphone app is asking for trouble? Not at all. Today we are talking about the Tesla smartphone. Whoa, this company is working on their progress like no other. Before we start our video, I welcome you all to our YouTube channel. We post daily updates from the world of space. If you like our videos and want to see more of them, keep supporting us. Now let's get started with our video. Designer Antonio De Rose and his ADR Studio Design Lab presented a concept of a Tesla smartphone in early 2021. They weren't just idea graphics either. ADR released an entire concept film of what a Tesla smartphone, nicknamed the Model Pi or Model P, may look like. It was partially for fun and partly to showcase ADR's ongoing design skills. After all, the company is already well known for its Apple product conceptions. Now that there are speculations that Tesla is preparing to manufacture a smartphone, ADR's concept images are looking a lot more fascinating. So what distinguishes this phone from others? First, one of the smartphone's primary designers, Antonio De Rosa, who created some of Apple's finest iPhone features and designs, is now working for Tesla. Let's take a quick look at the Model Pi's feature to see which ones are likely to make it onto a real-world version of a Tesla phone. There are some unexpectedly good ideas here. First up, it is designed for a Starlink connection. Starlink is one of SpaceX and Elon Musk's most important passion projects right now, and it's the ideal complement to a Tesla smartphone. The idea is to build a network of low-orbit satellites that will allow you to connect to the internet no matter where you are in the world. It's also getting increasingly helpful over time. Although Starlink has a long way to go, incorporating native support in a Tesla phone seems like a real move. It has connections to Neuralink. This, like Neuralink, is simply a pipe dream. Yes, it's an Elon Musk creation, and it even has its own website. But the Neurotech firm isn't even close to launching consumer-level brain-machine interface goods. And they must be consumer-level in order for a Tesla phone to offer native connections. The most we can expect from here are some fascinating medical applications resulting from Neuralink research over the next few years, such as assisting with assistive technology. It has a four-lens camera system. ADR made a straightforward copy of the four-lens system that was included in the early iPhone 12 concept art. In real life, of course, the iPhone 12 maxed out at three lenses for its rear camera system, and there's no telling what a Tesla phone could do. Cameras are often a way for new flagship models to try and stand out, but Tesla may have other ideas in mind. Built-in solar charging? With the correct accessory or case, solar charging is currently accessible for many smartphones. The concept is that you put out in the sun and it partially recharges your battery plus it's obviously eco-friendly. Ultrasonic fingerprint unlock. Biometric technology are an obvious choice for a Tesla phone. The business could theoretically employ some of the research in smart cameras for self-driving Tesla vehicles to construct a face ID system. However, fingerprint unlocking is another option. The ultrasonic sensor is situated on the touchscreen in the ADR concept. Integration with Tesla cars. Another no-brainer. Native compatibility for Tesla automobiles would definitely be included in a Tesla phone. This could easily incorporate features like lock and unlock, remote controls. This would not only be an easy choice, but it would also most likely be a main marketing point for the phone. Crypto mining resources for Mars coins. If you know that Elon Musk is bullish on colonizing Mars, right? Well, he says the phone will enable crypto mining for Mars coin. The crypto and governance coin behind what settles on Mars will need. By the way, Mars coin, or Mars, currently trades against USDT or BTC at XT.com and Finer Box. For those interested, Mars trades at a little over 6 cents at 0.061. Wow, it's pretty slick nevertheless, but it inclines towards the subtle sophistication of Apple devices like the iPhone 12, rather than a strikingly different form factor. But it's the slew of features that set the Tesla Model P apart from the competition. It's much clearer in the concept of Antonio Di Rosa, ADR Studio Design, the Tesla Model P, is set up for both 5G and Wi-Fi 6. But of course, this needs to be justified. The expense of an overpriced new gadget somehow, and the smartphone delivers, giving users access to Starlink. Now the biggest question. Why does Tesla want to make and sell a smartphone? Tesla has long claimed to be an automotive tech company, not just a vehicle company. This is also supported by the company's performance. Its stock price and market capitalization exceed those of the conventional automakers. Tesla is worth more than twice as much as Toyota and nearly 10 times as much as BMW. Furthermore, Tesla is overcoming the steady decline in auto sales. They're selling more cars at a time when the industry is experiencing chip supply problems. Due to these shortages, traditional automakers are unable to produce and sell more vehicles. Now, 
Why does Tesla want its smartphone when it's doing so well with cars? Musk stated in an interview that many smartphone software updates cause issues for customers, including compatibility, speed, and security. In addition, Musk, who owns an iPhone, claims that each upgrade grows less remarkable for users. Wouldn't it be cool if you could communicate from your phone directly to your car about where you want to go? Tesla and Musk see the goal of a smartphone can become the car's central controller. Use the phone to communicate with the vehicle so the car knows what you want to do and how you want to get there. So that's the motivation behind the Model P or Pi phone. Let's take a look at what it offers. We mentioned crypto. Now what exactly are the effects and benefits of Tesla Model Pi phone to the crypto economy? Mining Mars coin and using satellite connectivity to mine it may have significant consequences for the Tesla Model Pi. You might be able to mine additional POS and non-energy intensive POW cryptocurrencies using your phone. You might also use it to stake your preferred cryptocurrency without the need for other accounts. Consider your phone and your car conversing with each other. Your automobile notifies that you have received a portion of a block reward or how much you have earned in staking fees. On the other hand, there are three primary scenarios in which the new Tesla Model Pi phone will assist crypto consumers. Scenario number one, built-in wallet that crushes Apple Pay, Google Pay, and banking services. Almost everyone we know in crypto wants to unbank themselves from the crappy legacy banking system we have in most countries. Then imagine that while you're driving in your Tesla or just out and about with your phone, you don't need to use the debit or credit card system. You can pay through your Tesla wallet. There's no need for Apple Pay or Google Pay to protect your card numbers from getting out everywhere. Or your identity is stolen. Your crypto wallet can pay for it. Or maybe Tesla decides they want to develop a Tesla Pay to compete with Apple Pay. And you know, with Tesla and Musk, that they would make it fun and easy to use. Probably with reward points in Mars Coin too. Scenario number two, contactless gas and toll payment all in one place. Every car needs fuel from time to time, whether it's gas, CNG, compressed liquid natural gas, electricity, or plutonium like in Back to the Future car. But think about it with Tesla. The phone communicates with your car. The car tells your phone you're almost out of gas. Your phone looks up on Google map where the nearest gas station or charging station is. Your built-in wallet pays for it with crypto or one of the other many ways. You pump your gas or charge your car and then you're on your way, all in a matter of seconds. As you can see, every major toll highway has its system and many of them are incompatible. This could be contactless too. Instead of having your data and payment information out there, with EasyPass and five other companies that manage toll systems, a built-in Tesla wallet coordinating between your car and your phone can pay it and go. Scenario three, crypto adoption soars. With mining payments or even integration, of other services like Lightning or crypto debt cards, crypto adoption could skyrocket from where it is now. All these services are available now. Let us know your thoughts on this. We are more than happy to hear from you. With this, we've reached the end of today's video. If you like this video and you want to see more updates like this, be sure to subscribe to our channel to never miss out on any update from the world of space. Thank you so much for watching and we hope to see you again with new updates.